Good, and let's get an offensive player and a defensive player starting underneath the basket. One of the difficulties we have with younger players is teaching them how to dribble with their heads up and make appropriate passes according to the circumstances. So what does all that mean? It means <clears throat> if I'm dribbling with my right hand and there's a lead being made to my right, I need to be able to pass the ball with my right hand as a push pass. And one of the skills we're noticing more in competition these days, or we have for the last four or five years, is a skill being able to pass off the dribble. And if you get fortunate to watch uh, Argentina play, who just beat our boomers last night in a close game up in China, uh, watch a guy named Pepe Sanchez, who's the point guard, uh, Ginobili. Uh, they can dribble up, see what's going, and bang, make a one-hand pass to a person leading. So the push pass and the pass off the dribble is going to be particularly important for us. Now firstly, you might want to dribble up and have them catch the ball here and then make the push pass first. And then go into dribbling and then straight off the dribble, bang, make a push pass that way. So, you're on offence and you're on defence. You'll part, I'll be standing up here and as you dribble towards me, I'll either make this signal or this signal. Now if I make this signal, you'll pass with your left hand. This signal you'll pass with the right hand but I'll make it differently. So you've got to read how the defense is playing and then set up your pass. Okay, let's go. Not bad, good, okay, go again. Oh. Okay, not too bad. Now you can, you can go forward, you can go back, but if you can get by her, get by her. So it's a, it's, a, it's a contest, go. Good, much better. Good. Good, okay, not bad. Last one. Good, good recovery. Okay, take a seat, here's a ball. So you can, you can vary your position on the court, uh, wherever you want to go. Now eventually what we could put into that is, you're now only allowed to pass with one hand off the dribble. So we can set the defense up if we see a signal here, it's an onside move and then bang, straight off the dribble, make that sort of a pass. If it's on the other way, it's an onside or fake cro crossover or inside out or wave dribble, you all know what I mean by that. It's that drill. It's a little bit quick. You all see that? Just checking to see who's asleep. There's a couple of grins, not bad. So <clears throat> we can fake, we can set any pass up with our right hand, we can set up with an onside and then a pass that way or with our left hand onside and then pass with our left hand that way. Particularly useful in, in on ball screens or guard to forward leads where we need a quick delivery. We don't have time to catch the ball and go. Uh, only disadvantage at times, we need to be sure of the leader because once the ball's left your hand, you don't have that second one there to bring it back. But I think, it's a, I think the positives far outweigh the risks uh, in that particular drill. That's an excellent drill I think that we could spend hours on with our young kids. And you can change your position on the floor. You might want to start there, have the dribbler coming this way. Stay in the middle, have them coming straight on. Start over that side of the floor, coming this way. You can do it across the court, down the court, uh, whichever way you want. 